L-U-V Peanut, Love. L-U-V. Mr. Fish. Yes. The Heavy. Yeah, I don't play many of those. So yeah, you know, no, you it's, don't. It's, uh, you it's, don't. It was a nice departure. How did this, uh, how did you, they talk you into it, basically, right? You're a pretty busy guy. Well, uh, I'm going to be very honest with you. That was the last little bone my former team threw me mm -hmm. before I fired them all. Oh, okay. And, uh, and they didn't expect it to turn out. The way it did? To turn out the way it yeah. did. And I went and actually kind of used all that stuff inside mm -hmm. with this character. And it, uh, I think it worked out pretty well. Right, got to play a heavy. Yeah, it's kind of cathartic. It. Yeah, good yeah. cast. Very, 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 good, very cast. good cast. Common's great. I mean, Common yeah. is, who knew? Well, you know, all the all the characters in there. I mean, they, I, when I saw it, I didn't realize who they had gotten for all these mm -hmm. particular roles. Mm -hmm. And um, they got really, really lucky to get, uh, get the characters and the actors that they got to do this movie. I actually really did not know what I was getting myself into, but uh, once I read the script and read about Fish, you mm -hmm. know, I said, you know what? Mm -hmm. This could be interesting. The movie takes place in Baltimore, very mm -hmm. urban, and about the kid that's been orphaned and the uncle that's out of prison and trying to shake a new life by being tied to the past and coming of age and all of that. But you did not grow up. You grew up in, like, Northern California, right? Where are you, where are you I from? I grew up from San, in San Mateo, California. But um, that was not so far removed, not from, so far removed from madness. I had a brother who wouldn't mind me talking about it because he's done a complete 180. Mm -hmm. from what he used to do, but um, he was kind of like a Mr. Fish. Oh, really? Yeah, and that's what appealed to me about Fish, is that uh, if given the op opportunity, he would have mm -hmm. been anything else, in the, he could have been anything else in the world. That's one of the things that's kind of interesting it, it, to me, is that when we think of drug dealers and crime wars and all that stuff, it always mm -hmm. has an undercurrent, and obviously it is the violence and, and illegal, blah, 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 but it's serious business. It's very serious. And you have to have serious money incredible being made. Intel I mean, muscle and heavy and all the drama that, that you kind All of the things do. corporations do, but you never see it. Right. <laughs> all the pomp and, and <laughs> yeah. performance of what it takes to be that, that guy. But at the same time, you have to have incredible intelligence. Absolutely. To be able to sustain and do it for that long and be that successful. And, it's and kind you of come amazing. out of it alive. Mm -hmm. What would you be doing if you weren't an actor? You know what? I would probably be just retiring from special forces or something like that. Really? Yeah, either that or a teacher. Did you go? You didn't do any military, though, right? No. no? Wow. All right. Well, thanks for stopping by. Thanks for having yeah, me. It's good. It's really good to meet you, too. Good to meet you.